You think that's gonna hold off him? Oh no! This beast was able to create vortex. I don't think a steel barrier is gonna stop him. The invasive species, the Facto Forgo. This thing, oh boy. All right, this boss fight now here is a continuous hallway. There is a minimal end to this hallway. So my, my understanding is that use Use the Kirby's ability to use that blade holding. To do as much damage as you can. A uh, Forgo will basically travel to one area of the screen to basically to attack you with. So use the opposite side to dodge his attacks. But you can hit him no matter at any time, so use that to your advantage. Okay, let's get him out of here. We get that. See, that's why I say Buzzsaw is the best one. Get out of here. Oh, there you go. Oh, ugh. You can see like all the creatures he absorbed and it's like this thing is a virus this thing just consumes anything that he gets a hold of and become everything a Galantis ooze Just let that blade do its thing Go The buzzsaw is just awesome. I love this. Ability. Oh goodness. Oh No, you don't Hold that right there. Yeah, just eat it. Just eat it. I'm surprised it doesn't copy. It's, oh my goodness, this thing is just creepy looking out at all right and all forms of it too. Oh goodness. Booyah! Oh, you just got owned by Buzzsaw Kirby. I don't think we need to wait our time here. Oh, we're trying to absorb Kirby. Kirby's like, no, I... Oh, no, Elfin, no! Oh, no. F86 is going to become perfected. No! Ow. Knocked up. Well, he didn't want Kirby anymore. Hmm. Hmm. I have to save our friend. So, F86. What an invasive alien species. That thing just... Ate up everything. I just like that is just creepy in all all cases of the word. So, at the final stage of this fight, you are allowed to give every power up the game has, and you can choose whatever one you want. I am going to stay with Buzzsaw because I feel that's going to be well. Range attacks would be good. Yes, the range attacks would be good. Maybe I should go with Range Kirby. Yeah. Space, and we are fighting an alien species. Is no better fitting. Kirby become a space ranger and take the and take the fight to him. Let's do this, bad boy. Now, in the post, uh, in the arenas and whatnot, after this, you can fight a harder version of this fight, and it does technically give you a, a different ending of somewhat. But we're not going to go that far into the arenas. We're going to be doing the the original. We're going to be doing the the forego uh, post game, but not the arenas. Though. Oh goodness, it has become perfect. He's gained his true form. It is the ultimate life form, the Fecto Elphis. This thing is a flying creature, and no rightly so. It uses a pole arm to basically do its damage. Use dodge rolls to get away from those attacks. He's gonna be shooting out types of uh, energy spears at you. Oh goodness. Yep, use your, uh... Yeah, the fact is you just can't go back to the Wall E town to get health or anything. Yeah, this is a... You fight... You fight King DDD, you, then you go and fight... Um... Oh no, what's my power up? My power up? No! Take you out. Booyah, 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 booyah! Go take it down! Ow! That did not work well on my front. Nope. This guy has a few phases tied to him, so this is going to be a little tricky of a boss fight. Ooh, boy! 
He's gonna try to attack me like that. No doubt about me. Dodge, dodge. Dodge, dodge. Ooh, boy. So you can do, if you do a timing just right, you can just do a counter dodge on him every time he does that. So it's like, yeah! Booyah, 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 booyah! Yeah, counter, uh, counter attacking is actually more powerful than your normal attack, so... Oh boy, I'm glad I gar guarded that thing. Yeah, you're eating that, aren't you? Yes, you are! Oh, it's good in time. No! Space Ranger Kirby, come back! Take that, you. Ow. Oh, now he's gonna use his Vortex abilities to, to summon his own spears everywhere. I'm gonna power up. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, goodness. I thought he was gonna hit me there. That was gonna be shocking. Okay, here we go. Oh boy, no. There we go. Dodge Council, and there he goes. Now it's down to his final, well, second to last form, technically. Oh, that's not good. Oh, he's a bo Oh, goodness, that is fast. Ooh. Yeah, we got to these rocks are going to drop on you. They are fast. Ooh, da, 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 da. Oh, goodness me, that was close. Kirby, no! I right, get hit by that thing. Oh boy. Ooh. Kirby is gonna take you down one way or the other, you cursed space alien. Now we gotta find the one that the ring is gonna come towards. It looks like it's this one. So you find the one that's being healed, and he's trying to heal himself. So if you get him down to a point, boom, you can actually hurt him that way. If you don't get him in time, he will heal for that amount of the blue uh, feel he's got. So watch out for that. Yeah, bosses that can heal themselves. Annoying, to say the least. Unfortunately, he's too far away for Ranger Kirby to get hold of that. Ooh. Oh, Kirby, jump out of the way! Ooh, that is such a tight window! You ain't gonna heal this time again. Ow! Oh boy, Kirby! Nope! It's gonna come down to this, isn't it? Oh boy, just keep dodging. I'm gonna just keep dodging. Oh boy. Like, this guy just wants Kirby dead. Whatever the wrong reason. Ow, I'm gonna run out of health with this, aren't I? You little. I'm gonna die, aren't I? No! Oh boy! This is gonna be cutting it close. I wish you wouldn't do that. Ooh. Oh boy! Come on, you! Did you get down here? Ooh. Oh boy! Eat Ranger Kirby. Boom ya! Now I gotta get Elfman out of there. Use mouthful mode, capsule mouthful mode to do this. Hit him hard. Gotta move the control stick as much as you can. Come on, Kirby! Yes. Woo! That's tough. I just killed your control stick. I'm glad I'm not using the Joy-Con for this. <laughs> yeah! All one go, and Kirby is almost dead. <laughs> Don't worry about me.
But it seems Chaos Elfman is not finished yet. Alright, let's see how we finish this bad boy off. Oh, he's pulling that vortex. Oh, goodness. That's incredible power. Whatever it's trying to do, it's going to be pretty bad. What is it, Kirby? It's Planet Popstar. That's your hometown? Your home planet? Oh, no, it's going to... Oh, he's making Planet Popstar an actual meteorite. Oh, goodness. He's going to eat all the... He's going to destroy all the food. Kirby's not going to allow that to happen. Oh yeah, it's time to go <laughs> Optimus Prime much. Let's do this, mouthful mode. Let's do this bad boy. All right, Kirby, let's do this. Time to become... It's time to become Diesel Truck Kirby. Turbo Dash, your way to victory. This is almost like a victory road for us now. Yeah, we're going to basically launch this entire diesel from this semi-truck right into Elfman. Right into the Chaos Elfman himself. Let's finish this bad boy off. Yeah! Do 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 Oh no! Kirby! You see these creatures that have like this dark aura around their faces? Yeah, we're going to be dealing with those enemies in the... Uh, in the next area of the game, yeah. Oh goodness, Kirby jump to victory! Now this is part of the game where it's actually it's pretty cool, it's epic regardless. But this is where I feel like it's kind of dumb where the controllers have to, the, at least the way the attack Elfman is, it's just, you have to use your, you have to, you have to use like the B button, you have to keep tapping a button, and also type the control stick in different directions. So be ready for that. Yeah, we're gonna ram this bad boy right at you. Not on my watch. Oh, he's pulling out all the stops, isn't he? Let's do this. Yeah! Dash to win. Let's do this. Here we go. Oh, got my microphone off. No. Okay, here we go. We got to do this. Uh, come on. Nope. Not on my watch. Let's go, Kirby. Huh? Come here. We have the B button and the control stick at the same time. Yeah, this would really kill droid cons, really, to be honest with you. Uh, Yeah! Ram you to death! F86, you are toast! Woo! I mean... Well! <laughs> We're put back on Popstar. But the Vortex is... Is this kind of Popstar? We're back! But... The Elfman's Chaos Vortex is so big. It's being pulled in. Elfman has to make the ultimate sacrifice. He's the only one that can technically stop his own power, so... I need to close the connection between worlds! Even it takes all the power I've got. And he's uh, not lying. That is a pretty potent ability. Thanks for everything, Kirby. Elfman! Well, there goes the Forgotten Land. And Planet Popstar is back to normal. Oh yeah, Bandalvi. How how's how's the town faring? Huh? 
glowing light. And Elfman survives. Yeah, there's a bit of a spoiler there, but Elfman does survive and actually comes back to Kirby. So that entire sacrificing scene, completely pointless. Well, we are at the um, end point of the game itself, actually. That is the main story of Kirby in the Forgotten Land. Now, this is not the end, folks. This is not the end. Uh, we still have the uh, we still have a post world to go into, so that'll be up for this one. But overall, what we've seen so far, the potential for a 3D Kirby game is amazing. And I'm surprised it took them all the it took what was it close to almost you know ever since Kirby and the Crystal Shards in N64 to finally make the jump to full 3D. It's not bad by any means, technically. I just think. I just, oh, well, I can't really blame myself for not, you know, I can't find anything wrong with the game. I could say that the story could be uh, told better, in my honest opinion. You know, actually have more cutscenes. You know, indicating, you know, between worlds what was going on and everything. Because it seemed like everything was all was building up to this moment. Like, we could have had, you know, what was the reason behind the... All these being captured, what was the reason for King Dedede to, you know, defect? You know, that could have been, you know, wish that was explained better. It just feels like King Dedede just wore a different outfit and he somehow just got pulled into the vortex and then decided to work with the Beast Pack for some reason, just so he could just clobber Kirby for one for no good reason. I wanted to know the context behind it. But in that instance, though, I like the bosses. The bosses are pretty fun. And I still think my favorite world is still Wondria, just because for the music park aesthetic, it is just a lot good to. It's basically the least, you know, the least destroyed area of the entire game. And it just looks pleasing. Everywhere else just kind of looks like it's destroyed and distraught. And then all the Beast Pack is actually now friendly with us. Yeah, even uh, Crawl Line here. He wants to eat a Kirby car cake. But it's like. Yeah, see the beast. Uh, all, the, all the enemies we fought are now nice and happy with us. All nice and peaceful. It, it's taken to realization that the F8 ID F86 uh, creature actually just you know it took over Liangar, uh, Liangar's mind, and basically made him to to attain something to power up the machine for, just so that Elfman could come back, you know, come back into full power. Well, and there's the Howl Room we found early on. Not bad at all. Now I'm not sure there's any other if there's any other how rooms I do not know. I know of the two we have shown in this playthrough, but that's about it. Really. Ooh, look at that. That's above the one of the, that's up in, that's a that's a portal. That's somewhere we need to go next. That is the post game. That is the post game right there. And Kirby and Waldy. Bandana and D are, are are happy once again. And I do hope that there's going to be more 3D Curry games. I really hope so. I think this is a good effort. And it works well. But. Liangar. Has fallen. To be continued.